Hannah. Is everything in order? Uh, yes, your highness. Everything is prepared. Are you certain? Uh, yes, your highness. Oh? Because Claude isn't here to check your work, and I don't want anything going wrong on my special evening. Uh, of course, your highness. I made absolutely certain that everything is ready. I checked three times over, and if anything was out of place, I made sure to fix it right away. Good. Then you can be going. Of course, your highness. Um, should I inform your lady that you have sent for her? Yes, do so immediately. Yes, your highness. Calm down, Eloise. You can do this. You've talked about this with her before. Of course she's going to say yes. But if she doesn't, you'll still get to be with her. It won't be because of you. If anything, it would be because she's just not ready. Or maybe she just is afraid to commit officially. <sighs> Come on, get it together. Luca would want you to be brave. His big, strong brother not afraid of anything, is he? No. Especially not afraid of asking just a simple question. Okay. The ring is here. Everything is perfect. I can do this. I can do this. <laughs> Hello again, my lady. So kind of you to join me at such a late hour. I do apologize if I woke you with my request to see you. Uh, please, do come in. Have a seat. <laughs> do you like the flowers? I remember you told me that these were your favorites. So, I asked Claude and Hannah to arrange them in here. Oh, really? I didn't realize that our supper was your favorite meal. What a coincidence. <sighs> These past few months, living with you, spending time with you. It's been wonderful. And I know we've had our moments, disagreements, which turned into arguments, which turned into fights, but the good shines through the darkness created by the bad and looking back I wouldn't change a thing my lady there's something I must tell you you've asked questions before about how my servants are able to do such miraculous things. Things no human would be capable of doing. I've dodged the question before. Several times. But now, 
I believe it's time that I told you. You're going to find out eventually, so you might as well find out from me. Hannah, Claude, and the triplets, they're all demons. I can prove it, but you have to promise not to be afraid. This isn't something that you need to fear. You see, they're here to take care of me and to help me. They won't harm you, and I would never ask them to. Here, look at my tongue. There should be a mark resembling a pentagram on it. That is my contract seal. Years ago, I made a deal with a demon, Claude. I sought revenge on the demon who destroyed my village, and who killed my younger brother, Luca. You remember him, don't you? From all the things I've told you? Good. Claude has been my servant ever since I made the contract with him, and a while after I became the head of household here. Hannah and her triplets arrived. I don't really know why they came here, but I do appreciate their help, though I could go without Hannah's attempts to steal attention away from me. Not that she could ever steal the attention I desire most. Yours. But, it seems that soon, I'll reach the goal that I told Claude about, the wish that I made. And once my wish comes true, he'll kill me and take my soul. I don't know how much time I have left, but the time I've spent with you, it's the happiest I've ever been. Well, before I lost Luca, of course. And my lady, even if the rest of my life is short, I can't imagine living without you. So, now I kneel before you and I offer you this ring and I ask for your hand in marriage. I want to share each day with you one love, one lifetime, no matter how short or long that may be. My lady, will you marry me? You will? <gasps> I'm so sorry. I... <gasps> I'm not crying because I'm upset. I'm just 
just so happy and so relieved. I knew you were going to say yes, but but I was still afraid. Here, give me your hand. Let's get this ring on your finger right away. It looks beautiful on you. I can't wait. Tomorrow, you and I are going to start planning our wedding. And then we'll get married. We'll spend the rest of our days with each other. Of course. Yes, we'll stay here. <laughs> yes, your family can come to the wedding. I wouldn't want them anywhere else on that special day. Thank you. Thank you for agreeing to stay by my side, no matter what. Even if you didn't, I would always stand by your side. And now, nothing can separate us. <laughs> no force. Nothing of heaven, earth, or even the depths of hell. Nothing can tear us apart now. I love you, my lady. My sweet little butterfly. <laughs>